Manchester United versus Hull. Very low, though, for Manchester United. 1.2, draw 8, Hull 20. I don't think Manchester United have really had the best start of this season. Um, a little bit sort of let down. Obviously, they do come from that... 4-0 FA Cup Wigan win. Um, but, you know, it's a match that they really should have won. Um, but hopefully that will sort of fill them with confidence to sort of continue now on a winning run. Uh, the question is, is will it be a clear run or are things going to be quite tight? And I'm siding with the latter. Nigel? Yeah, I think this is... Uh, I think Man United will win the game. They're the better side. They've got the quality and uh, they will win the game. But I've been really impressed with Hull since they got in Marco Silva. I think mm. he's worked very well with the defence. I think they look a very, very different side, well organised. And I think they're going to be hard to break down. Oh, I think they go there with a game plan. They've played them twice already in the last couple of weeks in the uh, Football League Cup. They lost 2-0 at Old Trafford. They were 0-0 at half-time. And they, they beat them 2-1 last Thursday night. So they've got nothing to fear about this game. Uh, I don't think this is going to be a walk in the park for Man United. I do no. think they will win. But I think the 2.5, which is available with most firms, on under two and a half goals here is a massive price. Two under two and a half goals, two point five. Under two and a half goals. Because right now as well, a lot of bookies, you know, on some of the matches, they're actually offering the under three goals, uh, which is 2.03. So if you do see that third goal, you get your money back. It's, uh, you know, a bit of a sort of a guarantee there. Yeah, I think it's going to be tight. My bet is actually the under under three goals. That's the one I'm playing, uh, 2.03. I was kind of looking at being a bit cheeky and playing Hull plus 2.5, um, 1.64. But the odds were better for me to play the under three goals. Um, but I, that's what I was looking at. Alex, what do you like? Uh, I don't think that I read correct uh, the email of Nigel in this one or this <laughs> match. Uh, I will have the approach of Bernardo when uh, Hull played with uh, Chelsea, if you remember that. Um, okay, in front of Chelsea, they didn't manage to score. But I think that in front of Manchester United, they will score. So, my bet for this match and might have a lot of people swearing at me right now. Uh, Hull City to score, both teams to score in the match, 2.5. What the? I would probably play that, to be honest. Nigel, what do you think? Both teams to score. Well, I hope, he, I hope he's right and I hope I'm right. I hope it's 1-1 one, one and we all get the money. Oh, yeah. I hope we're all right. That's good. And then we'll Yeah, but we're talking get... about... And then, we're and then talking if, about if, uh, Natalie's, uh, Natalie's team right here. Well, uh, Manchester United. United. So we're all right. Let's hope we get the money. And then what we'll do is we'll send it to that prison that Alex in and get him out on bail with that top he's got on. <laughs> um, a lot of people as well think it's going to be um, going to be close. We've got half time under, under one goal Asian. Hull plus 2.5. Hoops, uh, hoops 596. That was one of the bets I was looking at. He was also going for Hull plus 1.5 as well. I think it's going to be really close. Hull plus two and yep. the under three. I think, I think it seems we're all on the same page. And then there's also a bet that I really like from Itrat Yahan. Um, Manchester United and the under 3.5 goals. Combine it. I think I, I missed that one, actually. I, I think I'm going to take that one as well. You guys on the on the Man we're, United. We're all football. we're all going the same way. We're all going the same way. We're all thinking unders apart from Alex. He thinks Hull will score, but um, <laughs> yeah, I, I, I think this is going to be very very tight. Man United will win it though, but one nil, two nil for me. <laughs> 